Hey guys, it's DRG Vinyl here. And today, this will be the last Pop Vinyl Finance of Freddy's Customs, at least until Wave 2 comes out. And I have so many in front that I can't even fit on the camera, on my phone. So, in order, we have uh, Freddy as Nightmare Freddy, as Nightmare. Fred Bear, White Rabbit, Low Bit, Toxie, aka Fixed, Tangled, and Nightmare Red Bear. And in the back, we have Mike Schmidt's Freddy Fazbear and Mike Schmidt's Nightmare Freddy. So we're gonna look at Nightmare, or Freddy as Nightmare. Some of you guys call this, uh, I think, Nightmare Version 1. I can see how you guys call that. It's a pretty clever name. But I really like how this one looks. I really love this. I really love how it came out. Nothing was really hard. The only hard part was getting yellow on on a on a black top hat, because you know yellow is a bright color, and it takes a while for it to take effect, especially with something like black. Same thing with the bow tie. The easiest thing was obviously overall the black paint, because you only need like one coat. A black paint but I used two just to be safe again I left the microphone in because I didn't want to take it out overall I like how it came out in general now we have red bear I really like how this one looks too he stands out oh, I thought I heard something sorry guys. again like all the other animatronics uh, they're all metallic well the eyes are sorry the eyes are metallic as well as the irises Overall, the, this was pretty good in my opinion. Again, I only need two coats because, you know, red is a pretty good color that only requires two or three coats. It's not like a light color, I'm like yellow or light blue. And White Rabbit is right here. This one was the, the easiest one. It just needs two colors, just black and white. Now that I realize it, let me see. Uh, I don't think I painted his eyes in metallic black. Maybe I did. If I didn't, oh well. But he's basically the easiest one to do. Just two colors, literally. Black and white. Up these two out. We got Lobit and Toxie, aka Fixed Tangle. Let's take a look at Lobit. This one's based off FNAF World, not really from Final Fantasy Freddy's sister location. For that pop vine, I'm gonna call that one Fun Time Low Bits instead of just Low Bits, so that way you guys won't get confused. Overall, I like how she looks. There is some dirt on the back of her head, but eh, it's not like I'm gonna display it like this. I'm gonna display it like this. Well, not like that, like this. Well, the hardest part about th this, these two pop vinyls was the ring in their eyes. That was pretty tricky to get because you can still see there's some paint flaws on the eyelashes. But it's no big deal. In general, you can still see the pink inside the mouth as well. That was pretty hard too. But overall, I kind of like how it looked. Now let's look at Toxie, aka Fixed Tangle. Some of you guys in the last video said, this is not Toxie, this is Tangled. This is not what Tangled looks like. Tangled is just mangled and recolored. This is just what would Tangled look like if she was fixed. So that's why it's called Toxie. I'm sorry I didn't make her look like Tangled from FNAF World, but I worked with what I got. Same thing with her. The trickiest part was getting the the rings around her eyes, especially on the, and underneath the teeth. Okay. Next one we got is Nightmare Red Bear. Again, same thing. He was pretty easy. Well, scratch that. He was not that easy because... Nightmare Freddy has great detail and tears all over his body, so it was kind of tricky to get those in, get the paint in. I had to couple of, I had to keep putting on black paint so it wouldn't show the red wouldn't show up on his scars or his tears, I should say. Again, I didn't paint his endoskeleton metallic silver because it wasn't really necessary. And uh, and the last two we have are well my animatronics that I made myself. These are my animatronics. Mike Schmidt's Freddy and Nightmare Freddy. Overall, I do like how these look. I like how they stand. Like, to me, these stand out quite well. 
as you can see there's some differences I based these off the action figures I have that I painted I also cut off their arms because well you know I wanted to base them off the action figure I made myself I had a hard time with the words because as you can see the E on this on Nightmare on Mike Smith's Nightmare Freddy is a little bit different than this one but I kind of made these for me and, don't, and I'm not really going to get rid of these so I'm, I'm satisfied with these Okay, so well now I'll just, now I'll just get all the other pop vinyls of Final Fantasy Freddy's that I customized. Hey guys, sorry I forgot to show you the paint again. I don't know why I forget to show you guys the paint I use. Maybe I just well I do record at night. Maybe that's why it just slips in my mind. But I'm gonna show you the paint I use to make Nightmare Version One. That's what I'm gonna call him now instead of just Freddy as Nightmare. So what I used, I used, well, black, just regular black, apple barrel black. For the fur, I used metallic black, sequin black for his eyes. It has a flower on the top of his head, that way you know what it is. I used metallic red, bright red, for his, eye, for his irises. It has a chaos emerald on it, so that way you know what it is. And... I used yellow for his top hat and bow tie, uh, bright yellow. And I used pewter gray for his muzzle and stomach, and his inner ears as well. Let me get these out of the way. For red bear, and along with nightmare red bear, I used, <clears throat> oh, I used well, metallic black. Again, Silkwin Black has a flower on top of his head for his eyes to make him look metallic. I used Metallic White. Uh, metallic White, Pearl White. Has Chaos Emerald on top of his top of a cap for the irises. And I used Tuscan Red for both of their fur. And I used Bright Red for their muzzle and stomach. And for White Rabbit, I really don't need to say this. Uh, I only use two colors. White for overall the whole body. Uh, metallic black or regular black. I can't remember which one. One of those two. So. And for a little bit, I don't have the orange, but it's basically the same color as the action figure. I believe I said Spice Carrot. If I said Spice Carrot, it might be that color, but it might be Jack-O-Lantern, just to be safe. And I also used Purple Iris for her cheeks, lips, and bow tie. And I used Metallic Gray, Gunmetal Gray for the hook. It has a Chaos Zone on top of his head. It's Cap, sorry, I don't know why I say head. Same thing goes for Toxie, aka Fixed Tangled. Except... I, I do use these colors, but I replaced the orange with spring green. Oh, and also I use metallic black and white for their eyes and irises. And the last two are my custom, my animatronics, Mike Smith's Freddy Fazbear and Mike Smith's Nightmare Freddy. I just use two colors, just <clears throat> bright red and white. I don't know why this... I don't, it says snow white, but it's definitely white. And now I'm going to show you all the Finance of Freddy's custom pop vinyls. And here they are guys. Here's every single Finance of Freddy's pop vinyl customs I did. We got Fredbear, Spring Bonnie, Nightmare Golden Freddy, Nightmare Shadow Freddy, Phantom, Phantom Freddy, Nightmare Phantom Freddy, Phantom Chica, Phantom Foxy, Nightmare version 1, Red Bear, White Rabbit, Low Bit, Toxie, aka Fixed Tangled, Red, Nightmare Red Bear, and my two animatronics right here, Mike Schmidt's Freddy Fazbear and Mike Schmidt's Nightmare Freddy. And as you can see, the count went up because at the time of recording, Red Bear, Spring Bonnie, Nightmare Golden Freddy, and Nightmare Shadow Freddy, I bought another Nightmare Freddy so I can make Nightmare Red Bear. So that's what I count one up. And I also, I will be doing these whenever Funko decides to release Wave 2 
of fun of the pop vinyl of Finance at Freddy's. I don't know when. Some of you guys said in the last video they changed the dates on the action figures, so I don't know when the pop vinyls and action figures are gonna come out. I don't know. Whenever I see them in stores, I will get them. Overall, tell me what you think of these in the upper right hand corner. But I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more. Bye.